We begin tonight with breaking news. Residents of a Grand Forks neighborhood are breathing easier after a standoff ends peacefully. Good evening and thank you for joining us. Police were called to a Grand Forks home on a welfare check. When they arrived, they say they found an armed suicidal man. Remember, it was only 48 hours earlier that two men died in a shooting in a North Fargo neighborhood. One of the victims was a Fargo police officer. Tonight, a perimeter was set up around the home at 1113 Fifth Avenue North after police say a man came out with a gun and then retreated back inside. They sent a code red telling neighbors to stay inside their homes. The SWAT and crisis intervention teams were called in. After about an hour, the man surrendered without incident. I think uh, for law enforcement officers, we know the potential of violence on uh, any call we go on. Uh, but when we do have a tragedy uh, occur within the region, it really just sinks at home that uh, this is a problem everywhere, not just, you know, large cities, not just, uh, you know, on the East Coast or West Coast, uh, you know, right here in the Midwest, uh, officers can certainly be targeted and uh, um, injured. Police add that the man, whose name has not been released, faces at least a charge of terrorizing. He was taken in for evaluation and will eventually wind up in the Grand Forks County Correctional Facility.